Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, I'm Caroline and I want to do a classic YouTube current favorites video. It is definitely mainly makeup, perfume, skincare heavy, a little bit of clothes, technology, but definitely on the girly side. But please subscribe if you haven't already, give this video a thumbs up and let's get into the haul. I do have my window open. I might have to close it. I just like, it feels so good. It's like 55 out and the breeze feels really good. Let's start with things that smell amazing. So Native just came out with a collab with Baked by Melissa. I have multiple deodorants from them and body washes. So my favorites are the tie-dye vanilla cupcake. This smells like vanilla, sweet. it smells like icing, like just sweet goodness. And then I love the mint cup, mint cookie or something that smells just like Girl Scout Thin Mints. So I have the deodorants and the body washes for that. You can find them at Target and online. It says limited edition. I don't know how long it's going to be, so that's why I've bought quite a few products. But they're so good, affordable. I think the deodorant, so the deodorant is aluminum free, like natural. I think it's like $12, and these are maybe like $9, but so good, so worth it. I've been using the body wash in the mint for a month or two now, and the deodorant for like a month and a half. It was actually my first time switching to natural deodorant, but it's been a very good journey so far. But definitely check out this collab. Next, I have some new products from Dossier. I have two perfumes to talk about, so thank you, Dossier, for sending me these perfumes. First, I have the infamous perfume that is inspired by the Baccarat Rouge 540. So I've smelled the real thing. I have smelled other people's versions of it. This smells just like it. I don't even know how to describe it. It's nothing, I have never smelled perfume like this before. So the name of it is Ambry Saffron. Again, it is inspired by the Baccarat Rouge 540 that is literally everywhere. You cannot miss it on social media. So it comes in the little box with a description. It says it's top notes, saffron, orange blossom, jasmine, plum, cedarwood, oak moss, fir balsam, and amber. Again, I have never smelled anything like it, but the real thing, I'm like, no joke, it's like $500 and Dossier perfumes range from $29 to $49. They also have uh, candles too now, which I do have a candle. It smells so good. I have the black opium one. And the next one I have is Spicy Orchard. Orchid. Oh my God, am I okay? <laughs> spicy Orchid. And it is inspired by Tom Ford Black Orchid. So cinnamon, pink pepper, mandarin, ylang ylang, orchid, plum, sandalwood, vanilla, and patchouli. It smells familiar. I don't think I've ever smelled the real thing of this. A lot of their perfumes they've sent me, I do have the real thing and they smell the same, they wear the same, they are long lasting. And again, they are the fraction of the price. So you're getting that same designer scent without the designer markup. This is really nice. I feel like this is maybe like a more of a mature scent. This definitely smells like your typical maybe floral perfume. This one, I truly have never smelled anything like it and it does smell like the real thing. I can guarantee that I have smelt it. But Dossier has designer inspired perfumes for a fraction of the price. I will put a link down below. They do have a fragrance quiz. So if you don't know what fragrance you're looking for, they can kind of help guide you in the best direction. They have 30 day money back guarantee if you're not satisfied. And again, they range from $29 to $49. And they also have uh, candles. So I have the YSL, I think I have Black Opium candle. They also have the Duar Sauvage candle, which I got that cologne for my husband from Dossier absolutely love it so check them out in my link below and thank you dossier for sending me these perfumes next let's top makeup so i have the makeup revolution blush palette it is the roxy palette and the mcknight twins inspired me to get this this is 15 dollars at ulta or target and i mean these shades are beautiful i'm wearing it right now i definitely put my makeup on like six hours ago i just went to a brunch and came back but the colors are stunning, only $15. And I was able to use that Ulta coupon. You know, they have like random coupons for $350 off. This does qualify. So I highly recommend it. I also am loving some cream blushes. So I have two Merit cream blushes. I did work with them on another video. This one is not sponsored, but I have Cheeky and Beverly Hills. These are stunning. Like this is a nice berry tone. It applies so easily. This is also Clean Beauty. And then this one is Beverly Hills. It's more of like a peachy pink, like the most beautiful natural finish. I also got a new Patrick Ta cream blush. So it is the cream and powder duo. The cream blush, again, it just glides on so smoothly. Looks like skin. This one is She's That Girl. They have a ton of shades. The Sephora sale is coming up. 
So you can get this for 20% off if you are Rouge. Everything he comes out with is just top tier, amazing, worth the price. Another makeup artist where everything is worth the price is Makeup by Mario. I have the Lip In Bronze Glow. This sold out. Like, it is so hard to find. TikTok blew it up. I was able to find mine at Kohl's because they now have, like, Sephora's and Kohl's. But it was sold out on his website, on Sephora. It was so hard to find. So, it's kind of like a mix between a lip gloss and a traditional lipstick. Feels so good, so hydrating. I'm gonna put it on. Again, I had it on earlier, like, hours ago. Do you see, like, the glossy finish? Oh, it really enhances your natural lip color. And it is so comfortable. You just throw it in your purse. Super cute and small. I definitely want to get more from the Sephora sale. I'm really excited. I think I want the Rose Gold, no, Rose Glow and Bear Glow and Mauve Glow. I want them all. And then another makeup product I have is also Merit Beauty. It's the Brow Gel in Brown. I believe they have three different colors. They also sent me this. I'm wearing it right now. I do not like the drawn on brow, the harsh lines, I never have. I just like a tinted gel to kind of like push them up, keep them there. I don't have a ton of brown hair, so it's nice to kind of give them some more pigment. So looks like so, a nice size brush, and you just kind of brush them through, and you're good to go. Looks so good, and I love this packaging. Let's talk skincare. So first I have this little headband. I am years behind on getting a little headband to push back your hair when you're doing skincare, washing your face. I have naturally curly wavy hair. So if I get like any water up here, it just curls, it looks crazy. Like this little thing usually looks crazy. I got this off Amazon, super affordable, and it has been a lifesaver when I'm putting my skincare on or washing my face. I have really fallen back in love with the First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Cream. I have dry skin, I have eczema, I put this all over my face, my body. Also picking this up from the Sephora sale. It's just so good, it's so thick and moisturizing and I've really needed it this winter. I think it's great for year round, but definitely in the cold winter months, like I have really relied on this every single day. Next couple products are kind of more like summery, I would say. Well, I picked tan in the winter because I do get tan in the summer, but I have these tan drops by L'Oreal Sublime Bronze Face Tanning Facial Drops. So I mix these in with moisturizer. You can either do it in the beginning of the day and it's fine under makeup, or I do it a couple hours before I go to bed, let it sink in, sleep in it. So depending on how dark you want, I do a little bit of moisturizer and about six or seven drops of this, and I put it on, apply it evenly, Definitely wash your hands. It has also gone under my nails and like dyes under my nails. So be really careful and just wash those hands. But it gives such a natural glow. It doesn't look orange or weird around your eyebrows. I got this off Amazon, maybe like $13, but really happy, so good. I have not broken out from it at all. And this is kind of new to me. It's a CeraVe Hydrating Mineral Sunscreen. I almost got the Super Goop one, which is like three times the price. This so is like 13 or 14 dollars super groups like 40 so it has a tint to it you can see i think it's just one shade but it blends out really easily like when you put it on your finger you're like okay this is like a medium shade but once you blend it in it blends in seamlessly with the skin it gives a really nice dewy look and again it is that mineral sunscreen spf 30 sheer tint really happy with it definitely gonna be taking this i'm going to mexico in a month and a half and i'm definitely going to be traveling with this i have one hair care product i actually was sent this by biz agent if you don't know what that is it's the same thing as influencer where they send you free stuff for reviews dp hues texture dry texture spray this stuff smells really good just i don't even know how to describe it but it's really fresh i love how it comes out it's like a hairspray nozzle and it really does give you texture and volume to waves and curls it just kind of gives them more bounce in life than just kind of like your normal look i've really been enjoying this i'm not sure how much it is because it was sent to me but I feel like it's maybe in like the mid 20s. I think Ulta sells DP Hue, but highly recommend. I've been really happy with it. Okay, I just got the new iPad Mini. It is the iPad Mini 6. It came out at the end of last year, I think. I got this case, I'll link it below too. I got it off Amazon. I did get the knockoff pen because the Apple one is $130. So I got the knockoff pen on Amazon. It works amazingly. So this has been I just, I'm obsessed. I use it all the time. I bought planners off Flourish. You can get them on their website or on Etsy. And they're just kind of like planners that you can write on with a pen. I am loving it. I am taking French again. I took five years of French in high school. So there's an app called Duolingo that I've been loving. 
I love the app coloring book notes writer lake sketchbook I mean there are so many apps that I love on here so I have been using this every day I can't recommend it enough I was able to trade in my old iPad and get some money at Best Buy for it and they were able to price match so if you want a new Apple product I definitely recommend the iPad mini over like any of the options last category is clothes so the first one they're in the wash right now they are by a brand called hey nuts I'll put a photo somewhere they are dupes to Lululemon Align I promise like I know everyone says that about like so many different ones these are the real deal I want to order more of them they are true to size I am a size small super flattering squat proof they feel like butter I'm obsessed with them another Lululemon dupe that I have I think this is the same as like the scuba jacket so i got an olive i got a size medium it is so cute like zipped up is really nice it has a hood i just got this olive color i've gotten so many compliments on it it's really nice thick material i think it said it wouldn't be here for a couple weeks and it definitely came super quickly so don't be worried if it says it'll get here in like three weeks it it'll come really quickly it comes like really vacuum packed but it's just really nice thick material and it feels luxurious for sure my last two items are bathing suits like i said i'm going to mexico in a month and a half and i feel like i need new bathing suits so they are from target the first one i got was just the bandeau top because i have so many black bottoms but it has this cute little knots on it i got a 34d i think they're pretty true to size i do think when you have a bigger chest sometimes it's too much fabric so technically 34d is a little smaller than i am but i just think Again, when there's too much fabric, it can look just unflattering and make you look bulkier. So this, I tried it on, it looks so cute. It's like a nice rib material. It was $28. And then I got a really cute set. And also Target, okay, this one I got a 34C because again, I was worried about like too much fabric. So I'm definitely like squeezed in there with that, but everything's staying in. I'm not gonna flash anyone, it's super flattering. So this one was, $30 so this is the top and then the bottoms I got a medium and it's called shade and shore if that's the line at target these were 18 and I love tie bottoms because you can kind of adjust them on your own so it's just like a really cute gives me like mermaid vibes but I got a few other bathing suits from them I think I spent like $140 on like four different bathing suits the other day but those are definitely my favorites. I cannot wait to wear them in Mexico. I love a bandeau top. They're just my go-to when I lay out in tan. So definitely get these. I feel like it'd be flattering on so many body types. So definitely check out Target. They have some really cute prints. They have all different types of bottoms, tops, anything for any body type. That is all I have for you guys. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to check out Dossier. I will have a link below for that inspired designer perfume for a fraction of the price. But please subscribe if you haven't already. Give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you in my next video.